Hey guys, so I thought I'd do a quick little update video. Um, Christian suggested this <laughs> to do a little backlog of my little office tour. So, I mean, as I told him, there's not really much to see other than on the desk there is a brow writer, Christian's brow writer, and then I have a little card that actually I was going to have done by a friend of mine, but I ended up having somebody else do it. Um, for my birthday of this past year and then I have an echo dot here that is not on yet a hole puncher to hole punch papers a desk lamp down here I have color pages I color a lot a keyboard like kind of like a bluetooth keyboard a book uh, a clipboard some more papers. Oh, my resumes. Those you might like, you guys are not gonna see. Huh. Old brow pages. Nothing down there. Oh, on this side, there's just some brow. All my ghost stories I worked on. Oh, down here is some brow papers. Now, these are not your standardized brow papers, so Christian, don't quote me on that. I know what you're going to say. You're not with your brow paper. <laughs> these are colored brow paper. These are cool. They have orange, pink, green, blue, and I thought I had yellow, but oh yeah, yellow and standardized white. And then, I guess I just the uh, folder up here with my ghost story pages. So, that's about it, really. I told you. Oh, some bird treats for Bonnie. A stapler. Don't want to mess with that. This is like a little jar of like different... Oh, wow. That's, that's a thumbtack that you hang pictures with. Little wallet. Up here, some pictures. This is a picture of me. It looks like I'm holding a bird. I can't really tell via the photo because it's like kind of like hard to tell and that one oh wait hold on no that is actually hold on that's actually my i'm even trying to look at it too um i think somebody that has to be no that has to be me with yeah uh at one of the bird sanctuaries i went to Ooh, it's like peeling really easily because this is on. Oh god. The next one is me. Oh my god. That was back at my eighth grade dance. Oh, me and Joseph. Holy shit. Me again in the photo booth, all by myself. And up here is. This is a little bird ornament that I had um, from a very special friend of mine. Um, I don't like talking about her, but Christian already knows. Um, I had a really best friend, really good best friend. Like, if I had to jokingly say that we would go back 10 years, I wish it were the case, but I've only known her for approximately three years um from a bird group and we grew a really really close bond me and her and she loved birds just as much as i did and she was just overall a, such a sweetheart and i could you not like i would talk to her about anything and everything 
like and the funny thing is and okay so I, I might tell you guys but the funny thing is she doesn't even okay so i'm gonna get really serious for a second christian don't get mad but a couple months ago i've already told you that i've written a letter to christian telling him i have feelings for him and that whatever i liked him and he was honestly okay with it but <laughs> i don't know <laughs> um but <laughs> so um i told suzanne that me and christian used to have a crush and those those that was something I always used to have a crush. Okay. no so it was something i've always told her and she'd be like oh does he and, she, and suzanne would be like does he know you like him and at the time she, he didn't so I told her, I said, no, actually, you don't. She's like, aw, when are you going to tell him? I said, I don't know, you know. So, you know, months and months go on. She was with me through the times I was with Colton. She was with me through the times when Colton split up with me. She was even there when Christian was being cyberbullied online. Bye, Colton. Like, I was sending her screenshots of Colton, like, bullying me. I even told her about the time that Christian was being, like, harassed on email, even. Even his mom. And Suzanne was just on mine and Christian's side. And so now that I even tell Christian a few months back that I have feelings for him, and the time that, you know, like, that things didn't work out this time again, I wish she were here for that, you know? Because she would have said, and you know what she, and you know what she would have said? She would have been like, well, maybe now is not the time, but I know for sure you guys will make it work. That's what she would say. You guys always make it work. Because she knows me and Christian are adults, and she knows that me and him know how to work shit out. She knows me and him know how to communicate, and she's on our side. And so for that thing up there, the bird, it's just, you know, I've always say she's just watching over us. This right here is actually a stapler removal, remover and it removes staples out of like papers that you didn't want it to go in the nice thing about these guys is the stapler and um the stapler removal or um pastel color mm. these right here these are rainbow color uh staples these are cool that's kind of all I have to show you. Oh, I'm going to show you guys the simulation in a second. I hope I don't get stupid here and staple my hand. But I need to refresh the... Uh... Okay, hold on. Oh my god. Okay, that's going to be a dumb idea. But let me... Alright, so we're going to do... Let me staple something so that I know it works. And then I'm gonna show you how I pull. Shit. Well, that didn't work out. Ew, now I'm moving. Oh my god, it's like all coming out. It's really like coming out. Okay, that was not supposed to happen. Anyway, so yeah, Suzanne was the kind of girl who would be like, um, you guys would always work out, trust me. Even if you and Christian aren't ready, I could see you guys still. Because she's the type of person. Not only that, she was 75 telling me all this. I'm like, oh my god, Suzanne. She had her way of making people's hearts melt in a way that 
I don't think anybody else could have. Um, so that's why I kind of wish, you know, she were here. <sighs> that's why I kind of wish she were here for when me and Christian did have that talk. Oh no, I dropped a staple. Like, there's a legit chunk of a staple that somebody could step on. Okay, that was not safe. Um, hold on. Because literally, I think what it just happened was it got overflow. I think I have to finish off. Oh no, it's still in here. No, I got one. No, I got the green one in here, the big chunk. Yeah. Sorry. I might have to um get down and see because there's Okay, so yeah, so yeah, that's a little bit of everything, minus up here now. Oh, oh wait, are the oh, I was gonna see, like, are they dying out already? Okay, so these are fairy lights up here. <laughs> 